Hello and welcome to Learning with Lisa. Let's find out about plants. While watching the video, keep a lookout for the plant spotter. I wonder how many times he will appear. I'll tell you the answer at the end of the video. Plants are living things that cover much of the earth. They include trees, flowers, bushes, grasses, ferns and mosses. Plants can be big like the almighty redwood tree or small like a daisy. Plants are all around us. Different plants grow in different places. Many grow in soil. Some grow in sandy places. Plants called cactus grow in the desert. Seaweed grows in water. A few plants can be found high up in the mountains too. Some need lots of sunlight. And others prefer to grow in shady places. Some even like to grow in rainforests where there's lots of rain. But plants all need these five things to grow. Light, water, the correct temperature, nutrients and air. Some trees keep their leaves all year round. These are called evergreen trees. Some trees lose their leaves for part of the year, but don't worry, they return again as the spring arrives. These are called deciduous trees. Have you ever wondered how plants grow? They often start their life as a tiny seed or bulb that gets planted in the ground. Sometimes the wind blows seeds from one plant to somewhere else close by and another plant grows. Sometimes birds help more plants to grow. Sometimes they take berries from bushes and drop them. Inside the berry is a little seed which given the right conditions might grow into another plant. Have you noticed how plants change with the seasons? In spring, new buds and leaves form on trees. Daffodils begin to appear too. Summer brings lots of brightly coloured flowers and trees covered in leaves. In autumn and fall, leaves on deciduous trees gradually change colour. They turn from shades of green into reds, oranges, browns and yellows before finally dropping to the ground. By winter, Many trees have lost their leaves, but if you look carefully, you might see snowdrops poking up through the soil. Let's see how good you are at naming the parts of two different plants. What's the name of this part? Yes, it's a petal. How about this one? That's right, it's a leaf. And what do we call this? Yes, it's the stem. Let's name the parts of the tree. What do we call this? It's a branch. And how about this? That's right, it's the trunk. And what do we call these? 
Yes, they are called roots. It's quiz time. Let's see how much you can remember. Which of these plants do you find in deserts? Cactus, sunflowers, apple trees. You find cactus plants in the desert. Where might you find bluebells? At the seaside, in the desert, in a woodland. Bluebells like to grow in woodlands. Which of these does a plant not need to survive? Light, water, a pot. A plant does not need a pot to survive. Which plant grows the tallest? Giant redwood, apple tree, willow tree. A giant redwood can grow very, very tall. Which of these plants is an evergreen? A deciduous tree? A sunflower? A tree that keeps its leaves or needles? Yes, an evergreen tree is a tree that keeps its leaves or needles. When do trees begin to lose their leaves? In the summer? In the autumn? Or in the spring? Trees begin to lose their leaves in the autumn. The plant spotter has appeared 13 times so far. I've been busy spotting plants too. Let me show you some of the weird and wonderful things I have found. I hope you enjoyed watching my video, please give us a like if you did. Remember to watch part 2 to find out why plants are so important. Thank you for watching and see you again soon. Bye bye!